blessed to have really, really nice parents, and they're always looking out for me. That being said, though, you do quarrel sometimes. My relationship with my parents, I think, relatively is pretty good. Obviously, there are the moments where, being a teenager, I don't really feel like talking to them, don't really feel like letting them into my life. When something's on my mind, I usually go to my friends about it. I don't really talk to my brother. I do find it difficult to talk to my parents because they put a lot of pressure on me, say I can tell them anything. But that just makes me feel like maybe they just want to know and I'm not so sure if I want to tell them about some of my problems. I have a little brother who's about one years old, one year old, and my mom and I always argue because um, I have to watch him a lot and it's part of my job is, you know, as a member of the family, I do have to look after my, my siblings. Um, so I always think I should not have to look after them for very long. Every weekend we have like a little family movie night where we just um, kick back and relax, watch a fun little movie. Those, most of our arguments are over what movie we watch. We don't exactly get along all that well. I mean, we argue a lot. And um, kind of everything turns into an argument and it's kind of hard to get along with them sometimes. Yeah. My sister's like, no, let's watch Rainbow Pony Unicorn Saves Happy Clown Land. And I'm like, no, let's watch this awesome Terminator death movie. Well, being an only child is, it has its pros and cons. Um, the pros are your parents kind of become your brothers and sisters and they become your friends. The best thing about having a little sister is somebody to pick on. The cons are sometimes I do get lonely when my friends are away and I have nothing to do except sit and think. The best thing, honestly, is that you always have somebody to talk to or hang out with. She dances in the living room all the time. And she sings really loudly in her room so that the whole house can hear. <laughs> he makes irritating noises and I tell him to stop more than once very nicely and he doesn't stop. I have a big sister who I can really talk to about a lot of stuff, especially when, um, you know, I just, I feel my, in my inhibitions hold me back from talking to my mom and dad about it. She also always dances around the house a lot, so that, that gets in the way of just going to do things. Like you have to wait for her to like to finish her plie or something before you can move. And I dance in public too. That too. Sometimes I just walk away. He calls me a loser. And I like snap, and I don't like it like at all. But I call everybody a loser, so. Did you call me a loser more than anyone else? That's true. <laughs> Being an only child's fun to me because I don't really have to worry about some other kid running around the house or sharing something because I'm an only child and I get a lot of attention, which I like. So it's always nice just to have a sibling who's pretty much always there for you. Thank you.